Hi, my name's Reese from the Eastern Suburb School of Music. Gonna teach you another chisel classic on the bass guitar, this time ship and steel. Uh, it starts on the A, fifth fret of your very top string. We're getting one, two, three, four, five, one, two. As the intro, so it's just all fifth fret A, third fret to G, or one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, G5. That's it. Uh, pause the video when you're ready. Let's study the verse. The verse of this song sounds like this. The essential principle that you need to know to play the verse once again just moving between the A and the G the cleverness right throughout this particular song by Phil Small is how he does rhythm variations so when he just stays on A one two three four times for the bar um, sustaining the note if you want to know those ribbons rhythms grab my tab sheets from the patreon page sign on up you'll get all the tabs for the particular videos that I make currently uh, the second time one two three G G third time G A so a two bar rhythm pattern there A A A A A A A A G G A A A A A A A G A and that is Taking care of your verse. Pause the video, learn that verse. You might want to start to play along with my cover version as well. To find that, just look in the video description below or the tab appearing above me now. When you're ready, let's have a look at the chorus. So the genius of Phil Small, I think, is on display here with this chorus. We now get... Subtle rhythm variation. So you've got a distinction between the verse and the chorus. One, two, three, four, G, A. One, two, three, four, is now going to be your rhythm. First time though, it doubles the G. So the start, the first half of the chorus is this. haven't picked up those frets or notes just grab that tab off patreon to help you out we get this climb and then back into our uh, riff we go there so it's B to C sharp D to E and those frets, two, four, five, seven. Big open, repeats that. And a fill here, a root fifth octave. If you're not sure what that is, just look at the video description below and the tab appearing above me. Now click through to that. Uh, seven, nine, nine, and then the big open string. Look up the tab sheet as well, and you'll see that quite easily. And then it just returns to your riff. So let me play a chorus in full for you to give you some perspective here. Also look at that cover version to help you out. To put this all into perspective, let's play the whole chorus. We get a one, two, three, four. into another verse. If there is some variations or some slight fills, they're represented on that tab sheet that I'm talking about at the Patreon page. 
found at Reeslet on Patreon, R-H-Y-S-L-E-T-T. -T. Just look at the links below, you'll find it, or do a search. Pause this video. Next up, we're gonna look at the solo section, and you've pretty much got the whole song following that. So the solo, it starts on the chord B and B, B. And that same fifth and octave as a fill there, B, B, B. And it just moves up the octave. So it goes from the fourth fret to the sixteenth frets. Um, do my best to play this particular section where we get one, two, three, and four, and one, two, three, and four, one, and two, and three, and four, and one, two, and three, and then kicking in the, into this root fifth country style bass play. Uh, off into a chorus. You go from there, all represented on that tab sheet, grab it. Um, that would allow you to play the whole song knowing those parts. There's some really great little fills that I do want to highlight now as well in the last chorus, so let's get to that. Just this last chorus, we're starting to get just a little bit busier. Uh, starts with those accents. Then we get this. One and two and three. Back into our usual groove of the chorus. Uh, the build again. And a different feel with. 12, 11, 9, 7, 7. Octave at 9 on your first string, open string to kick you back to. Uh, let's just play that line, the fill in context. Slow down a bit. Let's hope I get it right. So that's your second fill that you're coming across. The third time is pretty similar to that. So it doesn't do the octave this time, and then it just grooves out for the rest of the song. and steal by cold chisel please sign up to that patreon page help us out in 2021 subscribe to the channel here eastern suburbs school of music on youtube if you've got a request comment um, or any questions in particular leave them against this video i'll answer them as soon as possible good luck with your playing of ship and steel by cold chisel awesome song awesome bass line feel small